It's almost that time again for teachers, administrators, and parents to step forward to show their support for Project Success and the 2003 Mr. and Mrs. Red Oak Pageant. If you've never attended a pageant, you don't know what you're missing. The pageant is a fundraising event to help raise money for the scholarships for Red Oak High School seniors, but the pageant is much more than that. Pageant coordinator Ms. Becky Packard would like to invite you to a night of laughs as four men and four women strut their stuff for the audience in categories of casual wear, beach wear, formal wear, and talent. They'll get a night of uh, entertainment, a lot of fun, a lot of laughs, and uh, good fellowship. The pageant is not a serious event and has packed the Red Oak High School Cafetorium for the past several years. This year, the pageant is shaping up to be one of the best in history as contestants are coming up with some wild acts to perform to the theme of the good old USA. Red Oak High School will want to come out and support our contestant West Campus Principal, Mr. Mike Burns, while Red Oak Junior High will be supporting Ms. Kim Patty, who looks to take the title of Miss Red Oak from another Junior High teacher, 2002 winner, Ms. Janie Hall. Mr. Sean Walsh will represent Red Oak Intermediate, while other contestants are O.T. Posadas, a parent representing Wooden Elementary, and Mr. Tatum Thorne, a teacher representing Shields Elementary, Ms. Barbara Runyon representing Eastridge, Ms. Lane Lord representing Wooden Elementary, and Ms. Ann Lee representing Red Oak Elementary. I wanted to help the students of Red Oak High School, especially with the drug-free program, and to help uh, improve the scholarships for our students. I would like to say to them, if I'm doing this, they have to be there and support me, and they've got to be cheering loudly, and every time they see me, it's cheering loudly, and, and uh, 100 for being there. Uh, I got involved, Chief Lindsay actually asked me when I first got here, and this is my third year here, Miss Packer has asked me for the last two years, and so I am involved, and I hope that all of the Red Oak High School students will come out and support this worthy cause, and I guarantee you, I have no talent, but I'm going to do the best I can in the talent portion. Besides the contestants' performances, the audience will also see some great entertainment from Christian vocalist Amy Douglas, who will perform a pre-pageant concert from 5.45 to 6.15, as well as performances from Red Oak Junior High Drill Team, Straightway 2, Casey Osborne, and the Wooden Elementary 4th Grade Choir. The room should be filled with good old red, white, and blue for this year's theme, and Mr. Red Oak 2002, Johnny Knight, will be on hand with Ms. Hall to pass down the crowns to this year's winners. Tickets can be purchased at the door for $4 for adults and $3 for students. You can also come early and enjoy Amy Douglas while getting a great deal on Herman Riojas' famous fajitas, which will be served along with rice, beans, drink, and a dessert for $5. Mark your calendars now for Saturday, February 8th at 7 p.m. for an event you will not want to miss. A trophy will be presented to the campus that has the most students and staff in attendance. We'll bring you the results and highlights on our February show.